It's actually a really interesting story and it tells you a little bit about the power of patience uh, and patients communicating about what's important to them. I had a young woman with uh, young kids who was a whole mass of yellow curly hair and she needed to get four cycles of chemotherapy to treat early stage breast cancer and she <laughs> said to me with disbelief, you mean I'm gonna end a few weeks after I start and I'm not gonna have hair, it's gonna take a year for it to grow back, this does not sound like a good thing. And you know, what happens to my work and what will my kids think and what's gonna happen to my life? And she actually went on this whole investigation, came back to me and said, I heard there's this thing called scalp cooling and got us in touch with people who were doing scalp cooling internationally and it started a whole big interest group and a research program at our center to try and help scalp cooling become mainstream, both by showing that it was effective and safe and by getting that information out there. But of course we had the big challenge of how to get that done. And my colleague, Laura Esterman, who directs our program here at UC the UCSF Breast Care Center, I uh, went to Bethany Hornthal, who had found a donor who was very interested in trying to help us get this work done because you have to have funding to get any kind of study done. And through the Laszlo Tauber Foundation and Bethany's help, we were able to do, conduct a series of two different trials leading to the first FDA clearance of a scalp cooling device. At the end of our trial with our five institutions, we were able to show that most women kept most of their hair. Almost 70% of women treated on the trial with different chemotherapy regimens that didn't include a drug called anthracyclines kept most of their hair and they were very pleased with the results in general and they tolerated the scalp cooling well in general. And based on the results of that trial, the FDA cleared the DignicaP machine as an acceptable method for cooling the scalp in order to preserve hair in women receiving chemotherapy for breast cancer.